in light of the Quran interpretation controversy involving Howard Lee, a DAP leader has proposed that state rulers or muftis issue a fatwa prohibiting politicians from quoting the Muslim holy book for political advantage. DAP Deputy Secretary General Tunku Zulpuri Shah Rajapuji said the ban is essential to prevent politicians from using the Quran as a political weapon to target their rivals in order to advance their private agenda. Tunku Zulpuri pointed out that rather than use the Quran to foster unity among Muslims, some politicians are using its holy verses in ways that will divide the community. However, he came to the defense of Lee, the Ipo Timur MP, against allegations that he had given his own interpretation to a Quranic verse in a TikTok video that went viral last week. Having watched the video, Tunku Zulpuri said Lee had not offered his own interpretation of the verse. On Tuesday, Lee issued a public apology for using an excerpt of the Quran to urge Muslims to support the current government after providing a statement to the police as part of their investigation into the matter following a report lodged by Jalinan Bersatu Sahabat, a para organization. Meanwhile, according to James Chin of the University of Tasmania, some non-Muslim politicians use quotes from the Quran as a means to establish a connection with the Malay community.